What's up guys, welcome back to Gladiator Strike, and this time we're reviewing uh, the Babla Pure Strike 98, the updated version of the racket that I absolutely hated in the previous generation of this thing. I really, really dislike the previous one, and uh, that's mainly due to the really small uh, sweet spot. Now, with the, all of the, the new rackets in the Strike lineup, I'm actually very enjoying them, and they've surprised me throughout the, the entire lineup. So, yeah, hopefully the margin for error and the sweet spot got a little bit bigger with this iteration of the racket. And, uh, yeah, without further ado, check out the specs. So, glads, glads, glads. Firstly, I actually want to thank everyone who attended the live stream last Sunday. The 84 legends at peak you glads are absolutely awesome. I honestly had a lot of fun to talk to you guys in a more direct fashion and I really hope that you liked it as well. Hopefully there's going to be more and more live streams to come, but for now that the emotional part is over, let's start with the review. I decided to leave the most popular model from the strike lineup for the end because why not? As I said, I really didn't like the previous 98 version of the strike at all. Small sweet spot and I could name like 5 rackets that did everything better than it from the top of my head in the moment. With the new one, it's way better. Let's start with the design. Oh no, that's still sh Let's uh, go to the serves right away, which felt really, really freaking good. Definitely one of the best rackets in the recent times that I've tested for serves, direction, power, stability, everything. And to be fully honest, it didn't feel that good in the moment, but checking the points that I filmed, man, the percentage of the serves was crazy good and the direction was great as well. Pranit, on the other side, didn't know what to do with them. By the way, Glads Pranit, the guy from the video where I pretend to be a beginner, is going to launch his own YouTube channel very soon, so definitely stay tuned for that. Now to the forehands. Flat shots? Yes, please. Top spin short angles? Sure, go ahead. I'm a 16 by 19. That's what the racket told me every time I hit a crazy sharp forehand uh, winner. Everything was flying the way I wanted it to. The only thing is that the sweet spot, although now approximately one football field bigger than the previous one, for the unexperienced players or for those who don't play at least several times per week is still going to be something to deal with. But then again, it's a 98, something like a Blade 98 would have the same problem. Backhands solid and very stable, but the touch of potential to open some unnecessarily sharp angles is really nice. Like, but like it's too good. There's no need for them to be so sharp. Like 50% of that angle is enough to do a winner to like Novak. So yeah, very good. What's up, Glads? Oh wait, hold on. Sun, sun is right in the. Oh, there you go, Glads. If you feel like buying this blah blah pure strike 98 which is way better than the previous one no offense to the owners of the previous model of this thing the link to get it is going to be down in the description below like always together with our exclusive discount code it's going to save you some cash helps the channel and we're back to the video going up to the net with this was a reoccurring thing not only because it feels really good at the net but also because of that ease of serve that you get with pretty much every serve because when you keep seeing that your opponent's returns are landing short why not use that and go to the net right finishing the point in a sexy manner so yeah it does feel good at the net but it's kind of like you know it's 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 easy to put away a ball that landed short because of the crazy surf prior to it so who is this racket for and who i would recommend it to the whole lineup of strike is pretty much for the same style of player with just slight variations aggressive all quarter who likes to attack and go to the net when the shots with winners and not be scared to risk with some crazy down the line shots this one lays in the middle between the 100 inch and the 97 versions and uh, it's exactly that the middle ground it's not the perfect one but it's the most middle one which one would i go for i'd probably pick the 16 by 20 version of the 100 version because i really loved it check out the review of that thing over there but uh is it the better one no but i do like the margin that it gives me for uh sometimes not hitting the sweet spot perfectly but actually now that i'm thinking about it it would be a tough choice to make i wouldn't go for the 97 that's for sure because it's just too much but the choice between the 100 and the 98 would be quite tough but at this point, I'm pretty much just vocalizing my thoughts, so let's stop this nonsense and move on to the grades. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.